Alan here from Lonesome Hearse Campground just outside of West Yellowstone, Montana. Uh, this is a great site. It's a National Forest Service site. I was last here almost exactly three years ago. Uh, the big difference was I was here a couple of weeks later, so I was here after the frost. Now I'm here before the frost, and there's still a lot of bugs and flies around, but I'll survive. Let me pan around to show you a little bit about where I am. I'm also going to link you to my original post on this, and I'll share a couple of more things that might be of interest. So you can see I've got a waterfront site. In fact, it's the same site that I had three years ago. You might have noticed the new toy sitting out by the water. Uh, that's what was in the case, and I'll be telling you more about that. Uh, it's a real interesting uh, boat kayak, and uh, I'm pretty impressed with it. Uh, and I'll have a full post on that and a full video on that coming up very, very soon. So Alan here from uh, RVAcrossAmerica.net, and... Um, you can see this post, uh, the stuff that I've written up about it, uh, by going to the upper right-hand corner, um, <clears throat> or by simply going to the link that I have down below. Uh, it'll be something like rvacrossamerica.net forward slash uh, West Yellowstone. We'll call it that. <laughs> so um, this is a beautiful area. You're about 15 miles or 10 miles east of uh, west of West Yellowstone. Uh, getting into the park is a snap. When you enter the park through West Yellowstone, uh, Yellowstone National Park, that is, uh, you are about oh, 15 miles from the nearest uh, features, uh, attractions, whatever you want to call it. Um, <clears throat> this campground itself is primarily uh, dry camping, uh, no hookups. However, there are a few sites that I see they have electric on now. Um, so they're definitely it's definitely worth coming to. It's $16 a night. Uh, for a single site. Uh, definitely recommend it. Beautiful place. Uh, nice people. Uh, had dinner one night with a couple of young ladies. It was a beautiful place and beautiful people. Um, some other folks have been inviting me to kayaking and things like that. Anyway, um, I'm about to head out for the day. I've got some things to take care of. And uh, well, if you go over to my post, you'll see the rest of my thoughts on this whole thing. And uh, let me just turn this back to the water so you can kind of enjoy this at the outset.